there's you I like to do these military personnel when they're just plain regular people um, I got two this time I'm gonna do in one video we got we got Colonel St. Lawrence uh, Colonel Kerry St. Lawrence from Incredible Hulk number 446 his first appearance she's an army officer um, brown eyes black hair uh, when she was a cadet at West Point Academy General Thunderbolt Ross was dismissive about her chances of successful career in the military inspired her to work even harder to pursue him wrong Carrie graduated third in her class assigned to capture the Hulk Carrie proved to be uniquely effective in her dealings with The green fiend. At first, she favored brute. At first, she favored brute force during her encounters with the creature, but soon came to realize that there was no point in empowering strong or tactics. After all, the Hulk only got more powerful. The anger he became. She thus began to use more subtle approaches to subdue the creature. Perhaps all the Hulk has ever needed is a young woman's touch. Then I have General Sawyer. First appearance of Sergeant Fury and his Howling Commandos. Number one in May 1963. His name is Samuel Happy Sam Sawyer. He works at the Pentagon. He's six feet two. He's 230 pounds. Blue eyes. Gray hair. He's basically a career military man. At the dawn of World War II, Captain Happy Sam Sawyer, so named because he rarely smelled, recruited Nick Fury and the 1st Attack Company into a special squad named the Howling Commandos. They took on the toughest mission. Sawyer also commanded the Maulers and the Deadly Dozen. After the war, the ro he rose to the rank of general. He was killed in an operation against Baron Von Strucker and Hydra. And that's two more military officers. Remember, guys, good all the time. All the time, guys, good. Keep on gaming. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Jesus loves you. Jesus God. Jesus Lord. Jesus King. Jesus is ruler of everything. And have a great wonderful day.